All right, folks, we have a 2003 Toyota Tundra SR5 4x4, one owner. It's got like 126,000 miles on it. Everyone knows this motor that's looking at this video. Everyone loves this motor. It is the million mile motor, the 4.7 liter iForce V8. I put brand new brake calipers, rotors, and pads, front and rear, brand new tires, serviced it all up. That's on top of the 25 detailed maintenance history records this vehicle already had. So it is absolutely ready for a road trip anywhere in the world. And, uh, you know, they'll, they'll just continually get more and more rare. This is a one owner truck. It has a leveling kit on the front of it. Uh, that's the only thing that's not factory stock, I believe on this. Oh, it does have a little aftermarket radio in it too. Uh, just kind of a slightly updated radio, but this thing is gorgeous. The body is in phenomenal condition. Um, we put brand new tires all the way around on it. They're kind of an all-terrain tire, very nice tires. And like I said, this truck is in absolutely gorgeous condition. Uh, so, so, so hard to find like this. We bought this from the original owner. I have people scouring the West Coast, up and down the West Coast for these trucks all the time. Front bumper, everything's in really near mint, I mean, it's mint condition. I do say near because he t scuffed something right here and touched it up a little bit, but that's really the only imperfection in the outside of the body. The undercarriage is gorgeous. It's locally owned. This is as rust free as you'll ever find a uh, 2003 super clean, dry undercarriage. Uh, extremely well maintained. And like I said, we just did $1,700 in, in brake work to this, uh, to this truck. So we replaced all the rear brake pads. Um, and I don't know, I don't have the receipt on me. Uh, it was $1,700 my cost, and I get a pretty good rate on stuff. There's the receipt for the tires too. Uh, I do have the receipt from the mechanic shop for the work we did on this, uh, for the calipers and for the pads and all that stuff, and for the new rotors. Those are brand new rotors brand new calipers all done up and then i can't remember what else we did but uh a, just a really nice solid tune-up and this truck runs and drives like brand new it's absolutely phenomenal condition the interior is equal excuse me for one second i had to flip that switch there let's go ahead and open this up check out that compartment all the floors are absolutely beautiful, no stains, all the original upholstery. One owner loves since 2003. It just doesn't get better than this in this class of truck. If you're looking for that perfectly maintained one owner truck, that's a very clean slate, um, look no further. This is that truck. It's got keyless entry, uh, two key fobs, three keys, it has the extra seat underneath here. You gotta flip the switch on this side. Oh, where is that? There we go. Flip the keys back. But just look at the condition of this upholstery. It's absolutely beautiful. It just shows that this guy took such good care of this truck. Familymotorcompany.com. There's a direct link to Carfax for free. Yeah, in a, in a world where everything's getting so much more expensive and so much more complicated, uh, the, if, if you're wondering why these trucks are worth so much, that's the reason. I just replaced an air conditioning compressor on a 2020 Toyota Tacoma, and the dealer wanted $3,500 to replace the air conditioner with the new refrigerant. Absolutely insane. I got it done for $1,800. That's the most reasonable place I could find that has the new refrigerant with the new pump. Uh, so they're no longer using R134A. And it's those kind of ignorant things that are making people want these trucks that were, they've proven themselves to be insanely reliable. There's several of these out there with over a million miles on them. That's original engine and transmission. This one's got 126,000 miles and it's a one owner truck. 
everything on this truck is simple. Everything on this truck is relatively inexpensive. And this truck has proven itself to be the most reliable Tundra ever built. So, so there it is, you know, I mean, I need to leave it running so we can do a video. That's, that's the reason people are wanting this truck. Sounds like that new belt is a little squeaky. This is up here. It's got a new Everstart battery in it. I did not put the Everstart battery in it. I don't run Everstart. Listen to that motor purr. Absolutely beautiful. And this thing's clean and dry underneath. There's the catalyst information. Uh, transmission fluid's like new. We didn't have it serviced. Brake fluid was like new. Just an extremely well maintained vehicle. It's got all the original uh, VIN numbers on every panel. And it is, let's see here. 4.7 liter I4 GA. Is that the catalyst? Yeah. OBD2 certified US and Canada. I'm not sure if it's California emissions tested or not. You should be able to tell by this. Normally it says California on it. This one doesn't say California on it. I'm not sure. You can look it up from that, that number. That's why I held on there for a minute. But guys, this truck is amazing. It will last you forever if you take care of it. Uh, one of the most beloved trucks of all time. So don't don't wait on this one. If that's what you've been looking for, come out, buy it. Uh, or we can ship it to you. You will not be disappointed in this truck. Uh, and it does have the 6.5 foot bed. Thanks for watching.